My name is Al Link. I'm an electronics hobbyist and the creator of Pixel. Pixel is an LED display for pixel art. Pixel art is this low resolution retro art form, really a throwback to the video game art of the 80s and early 90s. And I just had the idea, you know, why not take this very low resolution art form, combine it and bring it to the LED platform. So I called up a few friends and together we developed the first version of the hardware. Um, it took us about six months to do that. And we did a Kickstarter back in the early part of 2013. We were fortunate enough to get funded, um, had a great experience. We ended up shipping over 300 units. Um, but most importantly, we got a lot of great feedback from you, the community. Um, you guys told us what you liked, what you didn't like, and I'm happy to say that I wouldn't say we did all of the feedback. You know, I wish I could say that. But uh, most of the feedback we were able to incorporate in uh, version 2.0 of the product that you see here. I'm Itai. I'm the creator of the YoYo board that lets you very easily connect Android devices and PCs to external electronic circuits. In order to support Pixel, I extended the YoYo firmware so that it can talk to the LED matrix and stream animations to it. Eventually, we even ended up spinning a custom version of the YoYo that has um, an SD card reader for storing the animations locally as well as all the connectors that are required to easily connect the matrix. One of the requests from the end users from the version 1 was to create animations and not have the Android connected all the time. So this was taken care in the version 2 as an extension to the board an SD card interface was provided. When you select the animation from the phone, it's going to write to the device. I can then turn my phone off, walk away, the animation will keep running. So that was the big ask uh, from version one. Uh, happy to say we're able to uh, include that in version two. And I hope you guys like that. We think the hardware for Pixel is pretty awesome, but honestly, what really makes the product, at least in my opinion, is the content. We knew that producing a piece of hardware without content wasn't going to be that compelling. So we reached out to um, artists all over the world in the, in the pixel art community. Ended up collaborating with 10 pixel artists located all over the world. Um, they in turn did over 150 unique pieces of work just for pixel, uh, which you know, in my opinion just turned out fantastic. Para mí, pixel art is an arte contemporáneo. Lo mismo, Pixel es la mejor, el mejor lienzo para un artista donde puede mostrar sus trabajos de forma interactiva, de forma entretenida y a la vez exponer sus propias ideas y comunicar sus trabajos avance de Pixel. Using Pixel is really easy. Run one of Pixel's apps from your Android device or PC and then just select the image or animation you want. Pixel also comes with a few interactive Android apps. Check the weather, or get your Magic 8 Ball fortune. And of course, you can create your own pixel art too. Hang pixel on the wall or put Pixel on your desk. Use Pixel as a message board. The optional mixed media panels allow you to combine LED art with print. Use the optional proximity sensor for interactive animations. 
or the alcohol sensor for a novelty alcohol detection app at your next party. There's also a kit version called Pixel Guts for custom installations such as this antique mirror or old electronics kits. Pixel is fully open source. We've also released a software API that will enable developers to write additional applications. And we'll be partnering with the same manufacturer who did such a great job supporting us on our first round, Seed Studio. The hardware design is done. There are a few things we need to do on the software, but the main thing is we need your help to fund the second manufacturing run. We hope you like it and have a nice day.